Hi guys, and welcome back to the Orr O'Keeffe Museum of Art in Biloxi, Mississippi. I am Douglas Myatt, curator here. We're in the IP Casino Resort Exhibition Gallery today to talk about what's, what's on the walls here. We're showing the work by Mississippi artist Kathy Hegman. Kathy lives on a farm in Holly Bluff, Mississippi in the Delta with her husband Frank and their adorable Chihuahua Pixie, who is uh, something of a fashion plate herself. Her mom makes all of her own clothes. Um, I'd like to start with a quote from Kat. The goal of the artist is to communicate visually and to touch the minds and hearts of others. And I think Kat does that as well as most any other artist I've ever seen. Her pieces tell stories. And I would put her in the vein of southern storytellers like Eudora Welty or Walker Percy or William Faulkner because she gives us so much information that we can form our own story looking at it. The figures and the animals that are in her pieces are focused more inwardly. They're not looking out at us and they're not immediately engaging with us. More so, I feel like they are asking us to pause and take a few minutes and to take a closer look at what's going on in the painting. Because when we look closely, we'll see that even though there are a number of things represented in the painting, a figure, you'll see animals, you'll see boats, you'll see all sorts of things, they don't seem to exist in the same space or necessarily the same time. Kat's a master of surface, and uh, surface texture in a painting is something that I find very sexy. And Kat is just brilliant at it. She has an, quite an arsenal of tools. We're both in Mississippi Art Colony, so I've had the pleasure of watching her work several times. But she has giant wire brushes that she scrapes paint off, and then she reapplies paint. And she's able to get these incredible textures that push and pull the figure into and out of the, the background, making us wonder even more what's going on. She's not trying to tell us a full story. She's simply giving us glimpses of moments in time that our brains, the way that they're wired, work together and create our own story. As I said, Kat doesn't give us the whole story. She lets us put it together ourselves. Um, I'd, like to, I'd like to finish with another quote from Kat herself because I think it really fits into the times that we're experiencing right now. She says that she hopes her pieces are, and I quote, respites of peace and quiet, even in the most turbulent times. 